The quadro version is older, and the quadro FX is an even older generation. Let's try the Quadro FX 3500. Now under SolidWorks version, we don't even see that SolidWorks 2014 is supported. We just see 2013 and 12 here. Now that doesn't mean that 2014 won't work with this graphics card. It's just not tested. You can still select 2013 and your operating system, and then show results. And as you can see, it is supported, but there are some limitations. If you want to read more, you can click on the notes. Limited video memory may cause instabilities with Windows 7, so that's a potential problem. Now, for example, if I select the latest version of a video card, let's say the Quadro K5000. As you see here, we've got support for 2014. That means it's tested. And let's check our operating system and show results. So here are two available drivers. You might try to use both of them to see which one works better in your system. Okay, let's leave the SolidWorks website and get back to eDrawings now. And I'll cancel out of the options window. One last thing to cover. Let's go to File, scroll down to Save As. There's a checkbox for Enable Measuring. Here it is at the bottom of the screen. Make sure this is checked if you want your viewers to be able to measure in eDrawings. I'll just cancel out for now. And this concludes our video about using the measure tool in eDrawings.